All right, let's open this package that I have literally zero idea where it's from, but it says perishable. So let's open it. Find out what's inside. Okay, they reached out to me and asked me if I would like to try out their product. Ugh. So this is Bauza, like bow buns, but they're pizza. I am so excited. So they sent me, you can get these in store too. I'm pretty sure you can get them at Myers. Um, I don't know, I'll link all the things, but basically, I got a two pack of the margarita, two pack of the pepperoni, ooh, barbecue chicken, cheesy spinach, Italian sausage. Y'all, I'm so excited. So I got, this is the barbecue. Look how good that looks, y'all. Okay, margarita, I'll do a taste test of these. Give a spot, creamy, cheesy spinach, pepperoni and Italian sausage. I'm gonna throw these in the freezer. So thank you so much to Bowza for sending that over to me. I'm so excited. Um, you look epic. So they're in a self-ventilated steamer bag and you just pop them in the microwave. You can also put them in the oven, pan fry them, like pot stickers, deep fry them, or air fry them. How exciting. So. I will try those with you sometime soon um, with Scott as well so we can get a little taste test, rate it, but you can find it in your local grocery stores. I know like these grocery stores is what the guy had told me. So check them out. I told Arlo about dessert, right? Yeah. Do you want to try one? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I make one. Make you don't even need to make it, buddy. I have it right here for you. Let's see what Arlo thinks. Oh. What happened? What happened? You okay? Are you okay? 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 You You Try the chocolate dessert. Mm -hmm. Here. Um, sit. You wanna sit and eat it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> You're gonna get chocolate everywhere, you little chocolate monster. All right. What do you think? Yummy. Well, you didn't even taste it yet. Here, careful of the chocolate. It's going to melt everywhere. Eat it like this. No, eat it like this. Mm. Is it yummy? Like this way. Like that way you like it? All right. We're gonna eat our chocolate dessert and then we're gonna go take a bubble bath. No! Yay, you don't like bubble baths? He just doesn't wanna go to bed. Hello, happy Friday. I just got back from the gym and now I came back. I have a hair consultation in about 45 minutes, which is really close to my house. But I came back to grab my camera. I realized that I had like dough in it from the other day when I was cleaning. So this is my favorite little nail cleaner thing. It's the Diamond Dazzle Stick. What's wrong, Miss Wingley? I probably need to order more. Cause I think this guy's almost out. Super easy, you just like wiggle it in there. Clean it out. And that's it. And then just rinse. Look at that sparkle, baby. Alrighty, we have. A busy day. Running around doing some errands, but they're fun errands. I love when they're fun errands. So it's 9.20. I decided to treat myself to a coffee out of the house. And today, I'm actually gonna go to Dunkin'. 
And if y'all are like real, real OG people, then you will know that, um, you will know about the Dunkin' Blueberry Ice Coffee from back in the day. So I'm gonna try it again, see if I still like it. I don't know if I will, to be honest with you, but it's gonna be really sweet. That was like when I first like got into coffee. But we're gonna try it anyways, cause I think it'll be fun and it'll bring me back to my days in, uh, days with Mike in college. <laughs> Um, and our trip to Cape Cod. Um, so yeah, let's go to Dunkin'. I might even get a bagel. I don't know, get wild. I don't, I'm not like hungry hungry, but I love a Dunkin' bagel. So maybe I'll just like get, eat half of it or something. I don't know. Um, all right, that's the plan. Then we're running over to get my hair consultation, which I don't know how long it's gonna be. I've actually never gone to a hair consultation, ever. I mean, I know why they exist, so that people can see what they're dealing with to give you like more accurate pricing and just like also know like what they need, if they need to order anything, da 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 So I like it, it I'm not mad about it, I've just never gone to one. So this lady must be legit. Um, but anyway, have that, and then I need to run over to Zara. I ordered some tops that I thought would be cute and they just were not cute. So I'm returning those and looking to see what else they have for fall. That might interest me. Um, and then what else do I have to do? I'm gonna, I'm gonna run over to Home Goods. I literally don't think I've been to a Home Goods since I was in, oh no, I went to one in Dallas, but like I never bought anything. But I'm redoing the office room that we have downstairs. Um, and for like Scott and like it's like a playroom kind of extension thing so I'm redoing that so I'm looking for a couple of things that I want to put in there and I'm just gonna browse through home goods then I have to run and pick up two target orders I placed two over the last couple of days so I'll share with you what I got there um, and then I've got a bunch of just random admin -y sort of stuff to do for work and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. We're gonna have a low key night tonight. We're going to the beach tomorrow. I ordered our low some sandcastle building stuff. So hopefully that still is on track to arrive today. Um, I'm so excited to spend the day at the beach with him. He's really excited. So let me check on that. And then um, yeah, that's pretty much all that arriving today. Yay, so the sandcastle stuff is arriving today. So I need to pack up beach stuff and be proactive about that and that's where we're at and one of y'all commented that I yell a lot I know I don't know I think it's just because I'm happy and I'm excited and I just talk really loud when I'm excited <laughs> sorry about it let's go get some coffee let's go get some coffee hey. medium uh, cold brew with okay. do y'all have blueberry flavoring Yes, we do. Can I get a, um, some blueberry flavoring and some cream in there? Okay. And then I will also do um, an everything bagel Okay. with um, garden veggie cream cheese on the side. Okay. That'll do it. $8.94, Thank you. La, 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 la. I got the bagel. We got the goods. I forgot to ask for sugar in my coffee. Honestly, I thought it the blueberry was gonna be like sweet, but it's not. Um, I will still drink it. It's still good. But, could have used sugar. And then, I always feel like Dunkin' adds so much cream cheese to their bagels. Which if you like cream cheese, then do you. But I always ask for it on the side, so that way I can just dip it and kind of, I don't know. Control it. Mm. Jokes that I thought I was gonna only eat half the bagel. <laughs> Bagels to me are like my total comfort food. I could eat a bagel, and I know I say bagel weird. I could literally eat one every day, any day of my life. I used to eat one like every morning when I was in college and after college, but my metabolism ain't the same it used to be. But anyway, it was so good. But yes, bagels are my absolute like comfort food. I could eat them at any time of the day as well for dinner. And Arlo got that for me because Arlo loves bagels as well. So I decided to run over to Target and pick up my to-go orders since I have like 20 minutes before my appointment. Um, Just, you know, 
optimizing my my time. Scott's gonna pick up steak for dinner tonight. I think he's gonna cook a nice steak, which I'm excited about. Um, I honestly haven't had steak in a hot minute. So, I think he's gonna do that. So mama's off a of cooking duty tonight. Pretty pumped about it. I like her, she was awesome. Um, so she <laughs> definitely noticed that I cut my hair myself. She was like, so, she's, and I was like, yeah, my fiance did. She's like, oh, he did good, but this side's definitely longer than this side. And I was, <laughs> I was like, yeah, I know. So she's actually gonna squeeze me in on Wednesday to do a cut and color, um, a full highlight. And she like explained to me, everything she's like I like to take my time I've been doing hair for 34 years and I'm like yes 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 everything yes um and she does use bleach which honestly you'd be surprised some people like refuse to use bleach and I'm like my hair pulls really really well with bleach so anyways I'm so excited <laughs> I found somebody that I like um so and she's really fine she's Spanish she's like good energy and she's like girl you're motivated me to work out coming in here with your gym clothes on so i liked her um so that's where we're at so she actually changed my appointment to next wednesday because um i didn't add a haircut to it so she said that she would cut my hair as well which lord knows i need it because clearly it's wonky so i'm excited because that way i'll have a fresh color fresh cut before our girls weekend next weekend in chicago like the the city city so that's where we're at. Now I want to run some fun errands, aka I need to go to the mall um, to return Zara stuff, and then I want to run to Home Goods. So I oop, bloop, bloop, bloop. I always have a list, even if it's like a boring list. I always have a list. Uh, I also need to run to um, Arlo's future doctor because I need to drop off paperwork for them so I can schedule an appointment at Woodfield. Um, pediatricians, which is super close to us. So, um, I'm probably going to run in there really quick. And, um, oh, it's closer to my house. So actually I will go on my way, um, to my house. Let's go to the mall really quick. I need to return some Zara stuff, um, and see what else they have. So just got out of the mall, did my Zara return and ended up finding a couple of things. They don't have any fall stuff out. I'm like so surprised that no fall stuff is out. I get that it's August, but like, I feel like all the other stores like have fall decorations out. But nonetheless, um, I grabbed a couple things. Also, I feel like they're never opening their dressing rooms again because they didn't have their dressing rooms open. So I couldn't try anything on, but I just grabbed a couple pieces and I live close enough that I can return it. I thought this top could be kind of cute depending. Um, I don't know. Depending. We'll see. I got this little dress. It's like a shirt dress, which is cute. Then I thought this could be cute for Chicago. It's just a little, like a bandage sort of crop top so we'll see like I said I couldn't try anything on so I just wanted to grab some things and then I can return them if I don't like them I also ended up keeping I don't think I showed any of this um I kept this little corset I need to try it on I don't know if you're like me but like I have to try to see if I like something I need the full visual like I need to have my hair done my makeup done like the right outfit because I just remember trying that on with like sweatpants and it wasn't a look obviously so that was my problem with that but yes i returned the tops that i got and just got a couple of new things anyway now i'm running over to home goods um to see what they've got for our office <laughs> What's up is down, what's left is right. Change. 
chasing stars and holding you. What I really was looking for in there. Um, I'm trying to do a couple of different tasks in my life right now. So the first thing is I want to finish that downstairs office and I found a cute little Chicago pillow and I thought that would just be fun because it'll always be like a little like reminder of like our time in Chicago if we live here, if we if this isn't a permanent move, right? Um, and then I found some more salad bowls. Since I've been eating so much salad, I wanted more of like a salad bowl and I also wanted one for Scott for like dinners and stuff. So I grabbed those, they were 10 bucks. Um, I wanted a hanging planter because currently we have one that's for like outside, inside, but I didn't find what I was looking for and Target didn't have anything, I browsed their site, so I just ordered one off of Amazon. And then I found a bunch of really cute artwork that I was like, should I pull the trigger on this? I don't know. There was some really cute ones, so I sent the pictures to Scott to get his like kind of opinion. He's very, not like opinionated in the sense where he'll be like, no, absolutely not, but he's very like, eh, I but, but like I could buy and he wouldn't be like take it back but I just kind of like to know before you know I buy it my hair desperately needs to be washed um oh maybe that's him no nope, that's not um so anyways I like to kind of get it cleared by him see what he thinks about it so I saw one that I really thought would look pretty above our couch because it kind of has blues and oranges which our couch is kind of like a tanny orangey sort of color and then we have blue accent chairs and then the king and queen like felt sort of pictures are so unique to me and I think they look super cool. And I thought could kind of look cool in the dining room area, um, which we don't have our dining room table yet, which they said it was gonna be restocked on the 15th. So I'm praying that it is restocked on the 15th. But, um, and then I saw like a carpet that also had blues and oranges in it. So I feel as though, I do really want to get those pieces. So the carpet that I, I liked, I don't know if Scott will like, um, but it was like 300 bucks, I think. And I guess I'm just not ready to like spend $700 on a rug. I think it's nuts. And then I wanted something big enough and all of the Walmart washable rugs that some of y'all recommended are, are smaller than what we want. We want a much larger rug. So we want ideally like a nine by 12. So they had that and I really kind of liked it. So I think I might try to take Scott um, maybe after work today just to see what he thinks of some pieces so that way we can kind of pull the trigger on some of them depending on what what his thoughts are. But um, I think it could be, those pieces could be really cute. So I took videos, took pictures and there was also like a felt sort of, I don't know. I feel like our style is slightly I don't know why I say mid-century modern. All of our furniture is mid-century modern. But I like the oranges and the blues and the whatnot. So, I don't know. I asked the lady at the counter, I was like, just as a heads up, what's your all's return policy? She's like, 30 days, have the receipt, and have, like, don't wash anything and keep the tags on things. And I'm like, okay, cool. So, I might um, get them at least because I'm somebody that needs to, like, visually see it. Um, and I also just did not know if those pictures and rugs and everything would fit in my house at the same time or in my car at the same time So I held off on it and we'll see what Scott thinks about it. I think all the things that I got And then I need to desperately clean my kitchen I oh mean this is almost out which is why You'll see why I got everything I got in my Target haul. Oop. I got some S You literally cannot see me SPF for the beach tomorrow. Some more dishwasher pods because we probably only have like five left. And I run the dishwasher like every single night. A new mascara because I was pretty much out of my lash sensation and I need to like break it in before next weekend. If you know, you know. Uh, I love the Mrs. Myers. I really loved the Bluebell scent, but I couldn't find it, so I got the Honeysuckle. Hopefully, I like it. Mm, the Honeysuckle's nice. Okay, I would buy the refillables of this. I need to next time so that um, once I find the perfect scent. And I really like the Honeysuckle and I like the Bluebell, so I would go with either one of those. This guy, because I still have a giant, huge mambo that I'm like thinking about going to the dermatologist and getting it injected because it's huge and hasn't gone away. It won't come to the surface some moisturizer because I'm out of mine and I'm just still trying to find a good drugstore moisturizer and hopefully this is it. And then, last but not least, I got two of these bowls from Home Goods. 
These are the bowls. They're kind of like soupy bowls. They're big. They make really good salads. Um, it's a, definitely a bowl and not a plate, but wanted these um, for dinner. So I grabbed two of those. Let's clean this kitchen. I'll sit down and get some work done. I still have not washed my hair. Um, I wanted to share with you a close-up of this dress. I tried it on earlier. Yes, I have a lovely pimple patch on my chin because it is massive. Okay, funny story, not funny. Not funny, haha. -ha. Scott's grandfather recently passed away. Obviously insanely sad. But you guys know how um, I always see stink bugs and that's like my reminder of my mom. Ever since his grandfather passed away, he's sent me probably pictures of like, I don't know, four praying mantises that he always sees at his window at work and I'm just telling him like, he doesn't believe in it, so I'm just like believing it in my head and I'm like, it's your grandpa. Even if you don't believe me, you can just like smile and remind yourself. <laughs> anyway, he thinks I'm nuts, but this is that dress that I was saying. It's super cute. Um, I wanna style it a couple ways and see if I'm actually gonna wear it. This is that corset top that I don't know if I ever showed you. I ended up keeping it because I wanna still style it and see what I think about it. It's just, it's average for what it is. This actually turned out pretty dang cute. Um, again, I wanna style it a couple different ways and see like what jeans I like best with it and whatnot, but it's like a little off the shoulder watercolor, kind of 70s-ish vibe crop top situation, but it's not super cropped and I would wear it really high-waisted jeans. Um, and then this, I thought felt fit really nice and it is a cute staple basic. How much was it? 35 bucks. Eh, not bad. I don't know if I'm in love, love with it. So again, I just like always take pieces and I have to make sure that like they're actually gonna stay in my wardrobe because I've wasted so much money on clothes that like I don't wear. So that's so over that. We also have like a crap ton of lip stuff on because my lips are so dry because I've never been drinking enough water and I keep drinking more caffeine. We have some things to get done. I caught myself just like mindlessly scrolling on the couch and I was like, get it together, girl. So, get it together. <sighs> All right, we're gonna get it together. All right, look, come in this way, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, sweet boy. He's very confused. Come on. <laughs> You're okay. I can't talk either. So, did you have a good day at the beach? Yeah. yeah. Say bye bye, beach. Bye -bye, he is super chilling. <laughs>